welcome back to my channel and welcome back for another YouTube video. I am on a roll at the moment. I just feel like this is the time when you guys want to see haul videos, when you want to see what is online at the moment, what you guys should be buying. And honestly, Nasty Gal is probably the best brand for discounts during this time of year. Like their Black Friday discounts are some of the best. So that is who I'm working with in today's video. I'm going to leave all of the relevant links to all of these pieces below, but there is a little bit more information for you guys. Nasty Gal currently have 60% off the site which is kind of amazing. I would recommend going on as soon as possible and picking some stuff out because of stock levels and things like that. I'll leave all of the links below with all of the prices and all of that stuff if you just want to click on it and buy it. Another thing I wanted to mention is that Nasty Gout are sponsored by Klarna. They work in par partnership with them which essentially means that if you guys want to purchase things in installments, then you can. Which is obviously really great if you see something you really like, but it hasn't been payday yet, and you know you want to grab it, but maybe you don't have the full amount. So I love the fact that they work with them. Again, I'll leave all of that below if you haven't heard of it yet, or if it's something that you're interested in checking out. But today I have got the biggest bag of Nasty Gal bits. I tried to pick a range from the website. We've got coats, we've got some slouchy pieces, some knitwear, and I am just very, very excited to get into it and show you guys all of the pit bits that I picked up. today's video if you are not already subscribed please go down there hit subscribe turn the bell on if you want to be notified when i upload on this channel and also leave me a comment below let me know what you guys maybe are checking out from the site and don't forget to like this video now that is enough of me just chatting now i need to get on and show you guys the bits that i selected so the first thing i'm going to show you is probably my most favorite thing i am so so happy that i picked this up i think if you're looking at buying anything this black friday and kind of around this sort of discount time it would be coats like coats obviously a little bit more of an expensive item so when they have a discount on them it makes them so affordable this coat is just so lovely i've seen so many people show things like this on from nasty gown they're always the american bloggers and i love all of the bits they select so i adore this it's kind of like a faux sort of sheepskin coat in this lovely cream color it has these pockets really slouchy really oversized i love an aviator they're my favorite kind of coat to wear it would look really nice with what i'm wearing right now just absolutely love this it has obviously the belt attachment that goes around the bottom i do have one of these in black and i wear it all the time so i feel like a cream one would just be so nice for this time of year everyone knows this kind of color is just a bit of me it really is like i love this color anything in this tone i'm here for it so when i saw this on the website i just had to grab it those wondering i did grab mine in a large i did want it to be like slouchy and big enough to wear knitwear pieces underneath so that was why i went for the large but yeah absolutely love this and i know nasty girl have some really nice coats on their site because i've seen them on instagram so i thought i need to pick at least one coat up okay so now i've popped on the aviator jacket this is again one of my favorite pieces from this haul i love this jacket so so much the color is gorgeous it's a really nice kind of like faux sheepskin all over the outside of the jacket and it's really nice quality as well again it comes with the belt along the bottom so you can either tie that when you do it up or just kind of leave it um i adore this i'm really really happy i grabbed this actually all of the detailing is like silver kind of hardware but overall this is so me it's a nice neutral color nice and slouchy i believe i got this in a large i will drop the relevant size below um and it's a really nice fit because it's not too boxy but i think i could definitely fit a piece of knitwear underneath here i feel like again this is a coat that i would maybe wear more in the evening because i just feel like it's a little bit more glam than like your average everyday coat i don't know why i feel like that but yeah i feel like this is something i'd pop on in the evening but adore this i love it you guys know it's in this color i was always gonna love it in this color um, and when i saw it online i just knew i had to grab it i will drop a link to this one below but i feel like this is going to be super popular so fingers crossed it is still in stock so next up i picked up a little dress i saw lydia millen showing some of these dresses i can't remember if it was this exact one but they were gorgeous from nasty gal and this is the kind of thing i wear so much at this time of year so essentially it's a nice little high necked floral black dress goes in at the waist and then obviously comes out this is so lovely long sleeves has some ruffle detail to it i fell in love with this when i saw it on the website i think it looks really expensive um and like one of a kind i also think they're really easy to style up at this time of year you literally just throw on some knee-high boots or you could do tights and doc martens throw on a leather jacket or a big aviator so so easy but they do look a little bit more exciting than like your average kind of jumper and jeans i love this i when i saw it on the website i knew i had to have it the fit of this is one of my favorite styles of dresses when they're really kind of high necked with like the shoulders and the ruffle detail 
and then they're a little bit shorter i just oh i i love this when i saw it online i did grab this in a size 12 just because i wanted it to be more on the larger side than the smaller side and it does have an elasticated waist so it will give you a little bit of shape you could also add a belt to this and give yourself even more shape but yeah this is definitely going to be a favorite in my wardrobe i already know so now i have on the lydia millen dress i actually think this is the exact dress that Lydia Millen kept showing over on her vlogs so I'm really happy if it is because I managed to get it because I think when I initially clicked on it it was sold out honestly this is such a lovely dress I feel like it's such a dupe for a really really expensive dress like it looks like a designer piece I love these dresses that have the high neck to them um it kind of like has a bit of a ruched neckline and then this sort of like ruffle sleeve oh I think that looks so so nice really great for the winter time if you want to throw on a pair of chunky boots do some tights you could throw on a cardigan or a jumper to add an extra layer I literally love this this is such a me dress this is where it hits me which I think is a really nice length sometimes with these dresses they're a little bit shorter on me but this is a really great length like I don't feel like it's too short at all I'd wear this in the day I love this I think it's a lovely shape super flattering the pattern's really nice it's still quite muted even though it's a bit of a floral pattern because I do love floral but I know in the winter time it's harder to wear this pattern so I think in the black it makes it way easier you could also throw on a belt if you wanted to but it does have the el elasticated waistband which allows you to kind of eat as much as you want which I love Okay, so the next thing I have to share with you guys is a piece of knitwear. I couldn't do a haul this time of year and not show you guys some of the knitwear they have on the website. They have lovely pieces. They had a really nice kind of like balloon sleeve jumper that was lovely as well. And I saw um, someone actually talking about it on Instagram. So I'll actually drop a link to that as well. But this was the piece that I grabbed. I just love this beige color. I think it's so, so nice. It kind of has like flecks of other kind of tones in it as well. And it's a bit more of like a beigey blush, which I really like because it's not too pink, but it gives you a little bit of a hint of color again it's a roll neck but what i like about it is it's a slouchy roll neck you guys know i like to be able to feel like i can breathe I don't want to feel like and sometimes with those tight ones I feel like I can't breathe so I love these kind of loose ones because they keep your neck nice and warm but that you don't feel like you're suffocating um it's a little bit more on the cropped side but I think this would be really nice with some high-waisted jeans it has a wider kind of sleeve detail yeah and overall I just love this really great piece for the winter and a great addition to my wardrobe okay, so next up we have this jumper I actually really love the shape of this um I wasn't sure what to expect but when I put it on I think it's a really really lovely shape I have just tuck this into a skirt it is kind of cropped enough to sort of tuck it in but it's also long enough if you did want to wear it with jeans or something low-waisted like it's not as short as I initially kind of thought it was but I just prefer how it looks a little bit tucked in it's really quite a boxy fit which I love especially for this time of year super slouchy very comfortable the color is really nice as well because it's not really like a beige and not a pink it's kind of in between which i love neutrals so for me this sort of color is really great in my wardrobe yeah i really really am impressed with this i didn't order too many knitwear pieces from nasty gal and i kind of regret that now because i really like this jumper this is what it looks like at the back for those of you that are wondering yeah overall i love this actually i think it's just a very handy useful piece to have in my wardrobe so next up i have this skirt oh my gosh I thought this was the cutest thing ever i am um, i really really love this actually this like black leather and star design i've seen it elsewhere as well and i think it's really really cute i think you could pair this with a little like band tee or graphic tee and some like boots and it would be such a cute outfit i don't know why this really reminds me of audrina from um the hills i don't know why i feel like she would wear this because it's kind of cool not really like my normal style but i really loved it um and it's a nice a-line shape which again i really love because i find it the most flattering if you did want to take this more into the winter you could obviously just style it up with a jumper and do some boots again or some tights which is what i do with all of my skirts at this time of year uh, and then also it's great for transitional times because you can obviously just remove like change it out for a t-shirt or change it out for bare legs so yeah i really loved this i thought it was a little bit cooler and i thought with a jumper it would be a really nice look okay so now i have the skirt on i've actually just left this on with one of the jumpers from nasty gal but obviously you could do this with a jumper you could do it with something a little bit more glam for the evening i am so obsessed with this when i saw this online i knew i was really gonna like it because i've seen this style before on like leather jackets and just like other pieces and i've always wanted one of these skirts that has like the stars on it so yeah i really really like it i like the fact that it's an a-line you guys know with skirts i prefer that kind of style where it's not like too tight if you will this would look really lovely with some tights and little boots i think but yeah i just think this is a really different kind of piece to add to your wardrobe um, a bit more of a statement piece 
So I got this in a UK 12 for any of you wondering. I am just over five foot seven. And I think the length is all right. Like if I had tights on with this, I would be absolutely fine. And then if I was going on a night out, I probably would go like bare legs. Cause you know, that's just what we do in this country. We seem to go out on minus degrees with barely any clothes on. Um, but overall, I really, really love it. I think it's super cute. And of course it's black. So it's gonna go with pretty much everything in my wardrobe. So next up I have something that's a little bit more out of my comfort zone. You guys have probably been able to tell lately that I have really been getting into these like blouses and like more, just a little bit more of a uh, more glam top, I guess, rather than like just a jumper or just a t-shirt. Because yes, you can wear these in the evening, but they're also nice to style up in the day and just make yourself, I feel, look a little bit more put together. So I saw this on somebody else's haul and I really loved it. It's almost like a sheer, well, it is like a sheer white kind of blouse shirt and it has all of this button detail down the front. It's really different for me, something that I wouldn't typically go for, but I love the sleeve detail on this. They're really oversized kind of balloon sleeves. And obviously they have the little cuff at the bottom. I just love this. I thought with a really nice lace bralette or white lace bodysuit underneath and some high-waisted jeans it would be a great like evening outfit like for drinks or something I thought if you did want to tuck it into a skirt you could it's just a really nice dramatic piece that changes your whole look and I feel like I need to be a little bit more braver at the moment and go for things like this I did get this in a 10 for those of you wondering okay, so next up we have this shirt which obviously when I spoke about this in the video I said this is a little bit more out there for me a little bit more daring but I do feel like if you wanted to pair this with something like some faux leather trousers which is what I have popped this on with it could be a really cute look especially if you wanted to do a heel for like drinks or something I think it would be really lovely obviously it has all of this sheer detailing to it so I actually think it would be better if you wanted to do like a white lace bodysuit underneath here i just have on like a pinky nude bra but i do think a white lace bodysuit would be better as you guys can see it has all of these little buttons which i really really like and gives you a little bit of shape so even though the sleeves are a bit more out there this like makes the top still fitted and flattering i think this is just the perfect thing if you want to kind of glam up your everyday look or if you wanted to do something that was a bit more smart casual rather than wearing like a jumper you wanted a more interesting kind of blousey top and I've said before like I am really trying to get into this style of top a little bit more I know they're super popular at the moment and I just thought this was a bit different obviously does have the super exaggerated sleeves which I know is not going to be for everyone but I kind of like this and again I thought with black it was a really nice um, pairing so yeah the cuffs have obviously again the little satin buttons Next up I have a little floral dress but this one is a little bit different for me it's more of a kind of like maxi it's not really a maxi I said I would say it's more of a mid-axi dress where it hits kind of like the calf um and it's lovely so the quality on this dress by the way is so nice this uh, mid-axi dress it's really heavy all double lined it just feels like gorgeous quality it looks like this it has a little bit of a v-neck and these kind of like floral sleeves and then it just goes down into this kind of tiered design with these sort of ruffles i do not own a medaxi dress like at all and i just don't know how because whenever i go to events or anything i always see girls in them and think oh how nice is that that looks really lovely so i was like do you know what be brave let's be a bit more daring and order some things that you've always wanted to try but been a bit scared to the print on this is lovely it's really winter appropriate again i think with some like chunky docks it would look really nice or you could do even like a nice little cowboy boot i feel like would look lovely with this very intrigued into what this is going to look like on me just because i've never really gone for a mid axi dress but i love the style of them so i will drop a link to this below because if this is like largely discounted i've got a feeling it's going to sell out super quickly because the quality on this is lovely okay so now we have the midaxi dress this is so great for this time of year because it does offer you obviously a little bit more length and it's a lot kind of like i feel like warmer so you guys might be really interested in this for obviously like December, January. I love the print on this. I think it's super pretty. I never go for things like this, but I'm really glad I picked it up because it's just different. And I feel like if I was going into London or like for lunch, it is something that I would gravitate towards. I'm glad I've tried it and gone out of my comfort zone a little bit. So hopefully you guys can see it a little bit better here. I will pan down and show you just where it hits me. It hits like really quite actually low down like it's longer than i anticipated but i think with some chunky boots it would look really really cool i think the shape is super flattering 
really different. I have a lot of black fur coats and I feel like this would look amazing. Those would look amazing with this dress, like a long kind of black fur coat. Also, for any of you guys wondering, I actually grabbed this dress in a 10. I don't know why I decided to get a 10 in this and not a 12, but I'm really happy that I did because I think if I'd got the 12, it wouldn't give me any shape around my waist area. And I think that is what's so flattering about this style of dress. So yeah, if you're kind of Wondering what size, I actually went for a 10 in this and I feel like it's a really good fit. The sleeve detail is lovely. It has this kind of like ruched bit and then sort of goes out into this flute sleeve. I really, really like this. Again, it has a little bit of a V-neck which gives you a bit more shape. You guys can see where it's hitting me. It is actually quite long on me, which I really like, but just bear that in mind. I'm about five foot seven for reference. And um, yeah, it's definitely like below my calf, but really cute. Definitely gonna be wearing this so much over the next couple of months. So next up I did order a nice little slouchy jumper. I saw this on the website and I loved it. I thought it looked really vintage, really, really cool. My, a best friend of mine actually has a jumper like this, which was her mum's from like, I don't know, like years ago. And it looks so cool. So when I saw this one, I was like, oh my gosh, they look really similar. I really, really want it. I live in these in the week. Honestly, guys, my week wear kind of average wardrobe is literally these oversized jumpers and joggers or leggings or something i just think they're great um even if you wanted to wear them like when you go to the gym just to throw on when you get out of your car i just love them so i grabbed this in a large because i did want that oversized fit it just says colorado on it and it's a really big boxy style jumper i feel like it kind of gives off that look of like being your boyfriend's jumper which you know if you don't have a boyfriend why don't you just buy yourself one of these? That's what I did anyway. Okay, so this is the slouchy oversized jumper and I am in love with this. I knew I was gonna love it, like it's just such a me piece. Um, I actually really like it with this skirt, but obviously you could wear it with like leggings and jeans, which is probably the more typical way that I would wear this. It's a really nice fit. Like I love when it has kind of like the drop shoulder. Um, I just prefer that sort of fit. It's almost like a boy's jumper. This I grabbed in a large for any of you that are wondering. I also like when the sleeves are super long. Just has the little Colorado print. I really, really like this. Nasty Gal do so many of this type of jumper online. So if you want something that maybe is in a brighter color or a different kind of style, they have so many to choose from. But this for me is just the most practical thing. I will wear it all week long. Yeah, I live in this sort of thing. And also like when I was at university, I lived in these sorts of things like i would literally throw this on with a pair of leggings and go to lectures at nine in the morning so highly recommend this jumper it's so cozy super warm definitely a bit of me and then last up i have another floral dress can you guys see there is a trend emerging here i'm just really into these for this time of year and also going into january they're something that i wear all the time and they're actually really good for spring because you can literally just change out what you kind of style them with which i really like i always say this but i like pieces that i feel like is go are going to take me through multiple seasons throughout the year and not just winter i love a floral dress for that so this one is a black little v-neck but it has more of a kind of like sticky out skirt i guess you could say it has like tears and almost like ruffles to it so it's going to come out a little bit more and be a bit more of a looser fit um i just loved this again i thought it would be really really cute with some doc martens right up my street it's a very me style of dress and i would just wear this with um, a leather jacket i also think if you did want to wear this in the evening like i would definitely wear this out with my friends i'd just change out the shoe and maybe pop on like more of a formal jacket but loved this one i grabbed this in a uk 12 for those of you that are wondering because i did want that kind of bigger looser fit and if you do want to give yourself some shape you can always pop a belt at the top section up here but these are so handy i wear them all the time okay so this is another floral dress that i picked up from the site i'm really happy i picked a couple of these out because I didn't have too many in my wardrobe and I do love them. Like when I put them on, I just love how they fit. They're so easy to style with like a leather jacket and some biker boots. Honestly, I really do love this kind of thing. So this one is more of like a kind of baby doll shape, if you will. Like it has more of like a less structure to it. It kind of just like goes out at the, at the waist. But I really, really like that. Obviously it has this little v-neck detail going on here. More of the like balloon sleeve and this is more of like a sheer fabric. I think this is like honestly gorgeous. One of my favorites from this haul video. So easy, like if I was going to an event or something in London, I would just throw this on with a leather, leather jacket and boots. And I feel like you look very put together, but it's so easy and so comfortable because the fabric is just so loose. So I think I did pick this one up in a 12, just cause I was worried on the length. 
I think the length is absolutely fine, honestly. Like, I actually really like it. It's a little bit longer than I anticipated, which was always nice for the daytime, especially when you're getting on the tube and in London and stuff. I prefer to have things that are just that little bit longer. Um, but I, I love this. I think it's gorgeous. Honestly, the Nasty Gal floral dresses are probably my favourite I've ever tried. Like, they just fit really lovely. The fabric's really nice. I think the pattern's really nice. They look so expensive, these dresses. Like, they look like they're from really expensive little boutiques I, I love i love this dress and again if you did want to pair a belt around it and make it maybe a little bit more evening appropriate you definitely could so that is it for my huge nasty gal black friday haul like i said i'm going to link everything below for you guys if you are interested in checking any of these things out i'll also drop the information regarding the code and the 60 percent off the site all of that stuff below in a little bit more depth I personally love Nasty Gal. I feel like they offer something a little bit different and I think they're really good for some of the like floral dresses and that sort of style things that I picked out. I actually did a video with them back in the summer but it wasn't an ad. It was just like stuff that I absolutely loved and picked out from the site. So I'm really happy to be working with them on today's video. I hope you guys find something that you like from this and if you do want to follow me on Instagram you probably see these pieces styled up a little bit more over there. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you're all having a great weekend and a great kind of discount time. Time. it is a bit chaotic but if you really go on the website find some key things that you like it's a really good time to purchase because of the amazing sales thank you so much for watching as always don't forget to hit subscribe and i will see you all in my next video bye guys